friends, welcome back to my channel. This is Cheryl with iStyle, my style, and I wanted to show and share with you this fabulous crystal chandelier that I picked up from Amazon. I was on the hunt for something to change out my previous chandelier, and when I saw this one, I absolutely fell in love. I love the shimmer and sparkle, and it just makes the whole room pop. Um, I picked this up for $200, so not a bad price at all from Amazon, but I just wanted to share it with you really quickly in case you are in the market of replacing your existing chandelier. So don't mind the things in the background. I'm in the process of de decorating, but I did want to share this with you. So I will leave a link for it down below. It was sold out. So hopefully it comes back in stock so you can snag this stunning crystal chandelier for yourself. I also wanted to share with you these beautiful deer that I picked up from Kirkland's. I showed you these in a quick short um, backstory on these. I had to travel far and wide to pick these up from two different stores. Don't mind the ornaments over there. I'm getting ready to decorate our main tree. And these little babies are the star of the show along with the tree. So I picked up the taller one. These were $149 for one at Kirkland's and I was trying to wait for them to go on sale. They sold out online, but I was able to travel to a local Kirkland's and pick him up for $112 after he went on sale. Yes, a little pricey, but a total investment and something that I will have years to come and to pass down to my children so that they can use in their home decorating. And then the smaller one was $99. So $200 for the pair, which I know was a little pricey, but I thought it was well worth it. And I absolutely love them. And I wanted to share them with you. Hopefully they come back in stock online. But if not, check your local Kirkland's because they are so pretty and I think worth the price. Next up are these really pretty plates that I picked up from Kirkland's. They remind me of a set that I saw at the Au Pair One that I was never able to get my hands on. I love the pattern, the white, and the trees. Um, this was, I set the sticker off, it was $6.99, but on sale, I believe at 20% off, so I got a set of four for $19.99, which I thought was a great deal. Again, if you loved the Au Pair One, go check out Kirkland's. They are bringing in some more modern pieces and I am here for it. I also picked up this vase. I saw it and I screamed, oh my gosh, this is so me. I picked this up from Home Goods. It was $19.99, believe it or not, for the size. I thought it was perfect. And I'm working on an arrangement here, so don't mind how it's currently looking. The deer, I've always had, you've seen those before, but I wanted to share this with you. So go check out your local home goods for some unique bases to use in your home. So I can use this one year round because of the style and the color. So me, absolutely perfect. Go check out your local home goods. I also found these cute little glasses from the Dollar Tree. Look how cute they are, only for a dollar. And they will fit perfectly in my theme this year with the deer and nutcrackers. I like the ice effect. Oh, so, so pretty. So I was only able to find five. So I'm on the hunt for a sixth one and maybe even more. But look at his little face. Oh, so cute. So absolutely love them. I first showed you these on Instagram. So if you have not seen my Instagram page, make sure you go check that out. It's I underscore style underscore design over there. So go check that out. 
but I absolutely love those. So pick those up if you see these out at your nearest Dollar Tree. I also picked up these black bottle brush trees. I absolutely love these. Um, they do need a little fluffing, but I picked these up from Hobby Lobby and my camera will focus. These were $12.99 at 50% off. And then this one was $5.99. So $3 and $6, $9 for those two little trees. And we are going to use these to decorate around the home. So if you have not hit the subscribe button, make sure you do because you do not want to miss that and see where I will be putting these in my home. Next up are this edition of these cute little nutcrackers. I told you my theme this year is nutcrackers and deer. And these little babies, I absolutely love them. Um, I was inspired by the nude nutcracker by Studio McGee, which are over $100. And the ones on Pottery Barn, also over $100. So I wanted to find a cheaper, a cheaper alternative. And here comes Michael's just in time. They had these nutcrackers and I saw them earlier in the year. And at that time I hadn't decided to use nutcrackers in my Christmas theme. So I didn't pick them up. But by the time I did decide I wanted to use nutcrackers, of course they're sold out everywhere. So I was able to find this guy, I mean, Michael's online. It was $17.99 on sale. And just look how big he is. He is 24 inches tall. For $17.99, I did not think that was a bad price at all. And then, of course, I had to pick up his little brother. Also from Michael's, he was uh, 14. I want to say and he is about 14 inches tall it might have been 12 I don't remember and then while I was out today I stopped at the Dollar General and look what I found their cousin and look he was six dollars oh my gosh and he's about 16 inches tall or maybe 14 same size as his cousin but oh my gosh six dollars you cannot beat that for a nutcracker especially when the ones from studio mcgee and pottery barn are so so expensive so these three little babies were a total score for me i absolutely love them i also have i'm experimenting with some centerpiece ideas for the kitchen for christmas that's why we have this little vignette set up i don't think it's going to stay this way or if the nutcrackers will even stay this color you guys know me I love black and white so we'll see but I saw these candlesticks on CB2 that I really fell in love with they were so expensive though and I'll put up a photo here and I wanted to try to recreate the look for less you guys know I'm all about the look for less so I picked up these clear jars from mm, Dollar Tree the bigger one in the back came from the Goodwill it was 99 cents so these were three dollars I bought some hammered metal spray paint and I sprayed the inside to give me that same effect of the ones from CB2 and again I will put up a photo here and I then decided to look for some smaller candle dishes that would give me that same effect as the one from pottery or CB2 I picked these up from Amazon I want to say it was like $20 for a pack of six, which I didn't think was too bad a deal. And then I picked up these black little candles also from Amazon. And guys, I think I have recreated that total look for less. I want to say, okay, so these were $3 for the jars. These were 20 for six. So... What is that? Three, a little over three dollars. So let's say three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. The candles were like fifteen. Um, I think fifteen, twelve, twenty-seven dollars. So not a bad price at all. 
to recreate the look for less. I absolutely love them. I will be using these in my home decorating for the holiday. And then of course I have my black charger here that I picked up from Pottery Barn. It was a splurge, it was $100, but I felt it was totally worth it. And then over here I have this little candle, this mer or not candle, this mercury glass Christmas tree that I picked up from the Target Dollar Spot. Um, doesn't have the tag on it anymore, but it's so pretty. And it was only $5 and it lights up. I don't know if you can see that or not. Um, I got the little tag still in it. It lights up. How pretty is that? And it only cost $5. So I thought that was a total steal because these are also very expensive on the Pottery Barn or CB2 or West Elm website. And again, you can get that same look for less as these were only $5. And I've paired it with some greenery that I picked up again on sale from Michaels. Um, these were normally, how much were you? The camera focus. $7.99 and I picked them up for, I wanna say $3 a piece. So not a bad deal at all. So that's my quick and short little haul for you today. I hope you guys hit that subscribe button and tap the notification bell and become a member of the family and come along on my journey as I decorate my home for Christmas. I am just so full of Christmas joy and Christmas spirit. Um, Thanksgiving was yesterday and I got to celebrate with my family and it was just awesome guys. I hope you guys also had an awesome Thanksgiving with your friends and family. It was just so nice to be able to come together after more than a year. So was so happy to be with them and I hope you enjoy their, your Thanksgiving as well. So again, if you have not hit that subscribe button, please hit the subscribe button, tap the notification become a member of the family. I am trying to reach 5,000 friends and family members by Christmas. So that would be your little Christmas gift to me and I would so appreciate it. So that's it guys. I hope you come back and I'll see you in the next one.